uh, playing Fabicine. When you planeswalk to Grove of Dream Pods or at the beginning of your upkeep, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal a creature card. Put that card into the battlefield and the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Whenever you roll Chaos, return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Hedron Fields of Ag uh, Agradim. It's on Zinnikar. Create the creatures with power 7 or greater can't attack or block. Whenever you roll Chaos, create a 7-7 seven, seven, Kavuos Eldrazi creature token with Annihilator 1. Whenever it attacks, defending player sacrifices a permanent. The Hippodrome. Plain Segovia. All creatures get a negative 5, negative 0. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may destroy a target creature if its power is 0 or less. Horizon Bogs. All permanents untap during each player's untap step. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may search your library for up to three basic land cards, put them into the battlefield tap, then shuffle your library. I feel like I've seen the art on that card before. Like on a land or something. Immerstrom. Plain Vala. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield, that creature's controller may have it deal damage equal to its power to target creature or player of his or her choice. Whenever you roll Chaos, exile target creature, then return it to the battlefield under its owner's control. Isle of Viserva, plain Dominaria. Whenever a non-token creature enters the battlefield, its controller creates a token that's a copy of that creature. Whenever you roll Chaos, destroy a target creature and all other creatures with the same name as that creature. Is it Steam Maze? Playing Ravnica. Whenever a player casts an instant or sorcery spell, that player copies it. That player may choose new targets for the copy. Whenever you roll Chaos, instant sorcery spells you cast this turn cost three less to cast. Jund. Alara. Whenever a player casts a black, red, or green spell, a green creature spell, it gains Devour 5. As a creature enters the battlefield, sacrifice, put 1 1 counters on it. Whenever you roll Chaos, create 2 1 1 red goblin creature tokens. Chrysig, Innistrad, prevent all combat damage that would be dealt to by non werewolf creatures. Whenever you roll Chaos, each creature you control gets a plus two, plus two, gains trample, and becomes a werewolf in addition to its other types until end of turn. We're halfway through these cards now. Karasha Foothills. Mong Sing. Whenever you, a creature you control attacks a player for each other opponent, you may create a token that's a copy of that creature. Tapped and attacking. That opponent. Uh, that opponent. Exile those tokens at the beginning of the next end step. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may uh, sacrifice any number of creatures. If you do, Kashar Foothills deals that much damage to target creature. Clean Spire District, Ravnica. When you or when you planeswalk to Clean Spire District or at the beginning of your pre-combat main phase, put a charge counter on Kill Spire District. Clean Spire District, sorry. And add red to your mana pool for each charge counter on it. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may pay X. If you do, Clean Spire District deals X damage to target creature or player. Crosa. Dominaria. All creatures get plus two, plus two. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may add... Uh, one of each color to your mana pool. Uh, layer of the Ashen Idol. At the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice a creature. If you can't, planeswalk. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may any number of target players each create a 2 2 black zombie creature token. Leith Lake. Arc host. at the beginning of your upkeep, put top 10 cards of your library into your graveyard. 
Whenever you roll Chaos, target player puts the top 10 cards of his or her library into his or her graveyard. Lanawar. Dominaria. All creatures have tap add 2 green to your mana pool. Whenever you roll Chaos, untap all creatures you control. The Maelstrom. Alara. When you planeswalk to the Maelstrom... Or at the beginning of your upkeep, you may reveal the top card of your library. If it's a permanent card, you may put it into the battlefield. If you revealed a card but didn't put it into the battlefield, put it on the bottom of your library. Whenever you roll Chaos, return target permanent card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Minamo. Playing Kamigawa. Whenever a player casts a spell, that player may draw a card. Whenever you roll Chaos, each player may return a blue card from his or her graveyard to his or her hand. Mirror Depths, Karsus. Whenever a player casts a spell, that player flips coin. If he or she loses the flip, counter the spell. Whenever you roll Chaos, target player reveals the top card of his or her library. If it's an online card, you may cast it without paying its mana cost. Mount Karelia. On Reg Regla ah. Regath the Regatha. At the beginning of your end step, put a pressure counter on Mount Krillia. When you place a walk away from Mount Krillia, it deals damage equal to the number of pressure counters on it to each creature and each planeswalker. Whenever you roll chaos, prevent all damage that that planes named Mount Krillia would deal this game to permits you control. Marasa. Zendikar. Whenever a non-token creature enters the battlefield, its controller may search his or her library for a basic land card, put it into the battlefield tap, then shuffle his or her library. Whenever you roll chaos, target land becomes a 4-4 creature that's still a land. And that does not end in to your turn. At the beginning of your upkeep, put a flame... Oh, Nar Ion. Playing Wildfire. At the beginning of your upkeep, put a flame counter on Nar Island. Nar Island deals damage to you equal to the number of flame counters on it. Whenever you roll Chaos, now... Isle deals, deals three damage to target player. Naya. Alara. You may play any number of lands on each of your turns. Whenever you roll Chaos, target green, red, green, or white creature you control gets a plus one, plus one until end of turn for each land you control. Nephila. Nephila. Nephilia. I'm messing that name up pretty bad. At the beginning of your end step, put a, the top seven cards of your library into your graveyard, then return a card at random from your graveyard to your hand. Whenever you roll Chaos, return target card from your graveyard to your hand. Norn's Dominion, New Phyrexia. When you planeswalk away from Norn's Dominion, destroy each non-land permanent without a fate counter on it. Then remove all fate counters from all permanents. Whenever you roll Chaos, put a fate counter on target permanent. Onake Catacomb, Chandelar. All creatures are black and have Death Touch. Whenever you roll Chaos, creatures you control get a plus one, plus zero, and gain first strike until end of turn. Orochi Colony, Kamigawa. Whenever a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, you may search your library for a basic land card, put it into the battlefield tap, then shuffle your library. Whenever you roll Chaos... Target creature can't be blocked this turn. Orzava. Orzava. Ravnica. When you, you planes walk away from Orzava, each player returns all creature cards from his or her graveyard to the battlefield. Whenever you roll Chaos, for each opponent, exile up to one target creature card from that player's graveyard. Artaria. Dominaria. Instant sorcery cards in your graveyard have flashback. Flashback cost is equal to the card's mana cost. Whenever you roll chaos, take an extra turn after this one. 
Pano Pato Pano Panopaticon. Panopaticon. I I can't say that. Mirrodin. When you planeswalk to this, draw a card. At the beginning of your draw step, draw an additional card. Whenever you roll chaos, draw a card. Pools of Becoming. Plane. Bolus. Meditation Realm. At the beginning of your instep, put the cards in your hand on the bottom of your library in any order. Then draw that many cards. Whenever you roll Chaos, reveal the top three cards of your planar deck. Each of the real cards, Chaos abilities, triggers, and put the revealed cards on the bottom of your planar deck in any order. Prov, Ravnica. If you cast a spell this turn, you can't attack with creatures. If you attack with creatures this turn, you can't cast spells. Whenever you roll chaos, you gain life equal to the number of cards in your hand. Quicksilver C, Mirrodin. When you planeswalk to Quicksilver C or at the beginning of your upkeep, scry 4. Whenever you roll chaos, reveal the top 4 cards of your library. You may play it without... Reveal the top card of your library. Sorry. You may play it without paying its mana cost. Raven's Run. Shanamore. All creatures have Wither. They deal damage to, in the form of negative one, negative one counters. Whenever you roll Chaos, put a negative one counter on target creature. Two negative one, one counters on another target creature. And three negative one counters on third target creature. Sanctum of Sierra, Sierra's Realm. When you planeswalk away from Sanctum of Sierra, destroy all non-land permanents. Whenever you roll Chaos, you may have your life total become 20. Sea of Sand, Plain Rabia. Ra Rabia? I I'm not sure. Players reveal each card they draw. Whenever a player draws a land card, that player gains 3 life. Whenever a player draws a non-land card, that player loses 3 life. Whenever you roll Chaos, put target permanent on top of its owner's library. Selesnia Loft Gardens. Ravnica. If an effect would create one or more tokens, it creates twice that many of those tokens instead. If an effect would place one or more counters on a permanent, it places twice that many of those counters on that permanent instead. Whenever you roll Chaos until end of turn, whenever you tap a land for mana, add one mana to your mana pool of any type that land produced. So this is basically doubling season with the Chaos effect. Shiv, Dominaria. All creatures have this creature gets a plus one, plus zero until end of turn. Whenever you roll Chaos, create a 5-5 five, five red dragon creature token with flying. Skybream. Kaldheim. Heim. Heim. Kaldheim. P players play with the top card of their library is revealed. Spells that share a card type with the top card of the library can't be cast. Whenever you roll Chaos, target player loses life equal to the number of cards in his or her hand. Sarkozen. Kamigawa, all creatures get a plus one, plus one to have haste. Whenever you roll chaos, untap all creatures that attack this turn. After the main phase, there is an additional combat phase, followed by additional main phase. Stairs to infinity, playing Zarex. Players have no maximum hand size. Whenever you roll a planar die, draw a card. Whenever you roll chaos, reveal the top card of your planar deck. You may put it on the bottom of your planar deck. Stensia, Innistrad. Whenever a creature deals combat damage to one or more players for the first time each turn, put a 1-1 one -one counter on it. Whenever you roll Chaos, each creature you control gains. This creature deals 1 damage to target player till end of turn. Stronghold Furnace. That is also another familiar looking art. Uh, if a source would deal damage to a creature or player, it deals double that damage to that creature or player instead. Whenever you roll Chaos, Stronghold Furnace deals 1 damage to target creature or player. 
Takanuma, Kamigawa. Whenever a creature leaves the battlefield, a controller draws a card. Whenever you roll Chaos, return target creature you control to its owner's hand. Tazim, Zendikar. Creatures can't block. Whenever you roll Chaos, draw a card for each land you control. Talon Gates, Dominaria. Anytime you could cast a sorcery, you may exile a non land card from your hand with X time counters on it, where X is the converted mana cost. If the exile card doesn't have suspend, it gains suspend. Whenever you roll chaos, remove two time counters from each suspended card you own. Timber City, playing Kinshala. Whenever the player taps a land for mana, Timber City deals one damage to that player. Whenever you roll chaos, each player sacrifices a non-land permanent. Trail of the Mage Rings, Viren, which is uh, Jace's home plane. Uh, instant and sorcery spells have rebound. Whenever you roll chaos, you may search your library for an instant sorcery card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Taraga Jungle, Ergmon. All lands have add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Whenever you roll Chaos, reveal the top three cards of your library. Put all land cards revealed this way into your hand and the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Turi Island. Plain Ur. Creature spells cost two less to cast. Whenever you roll Chaos, reveal the top three cards of your library. Put all creature cards revealed this way into your hand and the rest into your graveyard. Undersea City Reaches. Ravnica. Whenever a creature deals combat damage to a player, its controller may draw a card. Whenever you roll Chaos, you have no maximum hand size for the rest of the game. Velus Veil, playing Lorowin. Each creature gets a plus one, plus one for each other creature on the battlefield that shares at least one creature type with it. Uh, whenever you roll Chaos, target creature gains all creature types until end of turn. Wind Riddle Palace. Palaces. Uh, players play with the top card of their library is revealed. You may play the top card of any player's library. Whenever you roll Chaos, each player puts the top card of his or her library into his or her graveyard. And the last one is the Zephyr Maze. Plain Kenneth. Creatures with flying get a plus 2 plus 0. Creatures without flying get a negative 2 negative 0. Whenever you roll chaos, target creature gains flying until end of turn. Alright. So. That was the Plane Chase Anthology. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I really enjoyed opening it. A lot of, it looks like it will be a lot of fun to play with my friends. I uh, wish you guys uh, good luck in your openings, and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.